guys Kevin from Epic Gardening here as you can see the tower garden is alive and well very well in fact these plants have actually exploded over the last couple days and the reason being for that is because I switched from the seedling level of nutrients recommended on the back of the general hydroponics three-part series which is somewhere around five milliliters per gallon I probably went more like 10 milliliters per gallon and I switched it up to the vegetative growth section or recommendation, sorry, which is a lot more. So essentially my PPM went from somewhere around 450 and keep in mind my tap water is at around 350 so there's really only about a hundred parts per million of nutrient solution that we're talking about up to about 850 to 900 so that's an additional 400 on top, 500 total. So another basically multiplied it by five four or five depending on uh, how accurate the readings are. I also added this cool product I got from my buddy Max at Crop King called Zyme Alive, which is a biocatalyst that's goal is to essentially speed up the biological reactions that go on, go on when a plant's uptaking nutrients and transmitting them into the plant and helping the plant grow and produce vegetate, vegetation or flowers, in this case, vegetation. So obviously, don't have enough evidence yet, have not run a split test to know if that's the core reason for this explosive growth that I'm seeing, but I can't imagine that it would be hurting. I'm going to do a split test to grow in that in the future so I can make a better and more confident analysis of that. But just to show you guys, lettuce exploding, this kale over here, it's kind of in the shade, but that's going really well. The big spinach plant that I've got going on back here is doing really, really nice. And then all these bean plants down here have exploded as well, along with a cucumber plant. And I'm not even kidding with you guys. When I pH'd, re -pH'd the solution, added the nutrients, and tossed in the Zyme Alive packet, not kidding with you, 16 hours later, some of the leaf diameters on the lettuce and the spinach especially had doubled in size, and I'm not joking. It's really, really weird because I actually measured it. So something like this little leaf right here became this overnight almost which was crazy to me obviously that growth is slowed down as the plants are kind of adjusted to their new level of nutrition I think they may have been slightly starved based on uh, that evidence but things in the tower are going real well it's a beautiful sunny day here in San Diego and I've got a lot more stuff coming for you in fact pretty soon I'm going to be reviewing an LED light and setting up an entirely new grow so if you're interested in learning about that and watching the process of that Go ahead and subscribe to the channel, and if you like these videos, really appreciate it if you hit it with a like. Other than that, this is Kevin from Epic Gardening. Give you a little flash of what's going on over here, and I'll leave you with that. Keep growing, guys.